the sanctified life, no compromise with sin. John enjoyed the blessing of true sanctification. But Mark, the apostle, does not claim to be sinless. He is seeking perfection by walking in the light of God's countenance. He testifies that the man who professes to know God and yet breaks the divine law gives the lie to his profession. He that saith, I know him, and keepeth not his commandment, is a liar, and the truth is not in him. 1 John 2 verse 4 In this age of boasted liberality, these words would be branded as bigotry. But the Apostle teaches that while we should manifest Christian courtesy, we are authorized to call sin and sinners by the right names that this is consistent with true charity. While we are to love the souls for whom Christ died and labor for their salvation, we should not make a compromise with sin. We are not to unite with the rebellious and call this charity. God requires his people in this age of the world to stand, as did John in his time, unflinchingly for the right in opposition to soul-destroying error. The Sanctified Life, Chapter 8, The Ministry of John